Hello, you're welcome. How to solve this nice exponential equation? Solution from here. From what we have here, this follows on we have a times a times a. This same thing as a raised to power 3. That is here, we can express this as 4 raised to power x. 4 raised to power 3, then equals to 60 from here. Then also this follows when we have a raised to power m or raised to power n. This same thing as a raised to power m n. That is, yeah, this power multiplies. Then, what we have here becomes 4 raised to power 3x equals to 60 from here. The next step here. We take the log on both sides. That is here we have log 4 raised to power 3x equals to log 60 on this side. The next step here, we apply the power of log n. When we have log m raised to power p, this same thing as p log m. That is, yeah, this becomes 3x log 4 equals to log 60 on this side. The next step here, we divide both side by log 4. That is, divide this side by log 4. Also, divide this side by log 4. Then here, log 4 cancelled each other. Now we have becomes 3x equals to log 60 over log 4. Then, next step here, we can write 60 as 4 times 15. Then, what we have here becomes 3x equals to log 4 times 15 over log 4. Then from here, this follows the law of logarithm. When we have log a times b, this same thing as log a plus log b. That is, here we have 3x equals to log 4 plus log 15 over log 4. Then, next step here, we separate this into two fractions and we have 3x equals to log 4 over log 4 plus log 15 over log 4. That is, here we have log 4 cancelled each other, one left here. That is, 3x equals to 1 plus log 15 over log 4. Then also, next step here, 15 can be written as 3 times 5. That is, what we have here becomes 3x equals to 1 plus log 3 times 5 over log 4. Then here, yeah, this also follows the law of logarithm. All we have becomes 3x equals to 1 plus log 3 plus log 5 over log 4. Then here, yeah, we separate this into two fractions and we have 3x equals to 1 plus log 3 over log 4 plus log 5 over log 4. Then, next step here, you can write 4 as 2 times 2, that's 2 squared. Then, what we have becomes 3x equals to 1 plus log 3 over log 2 squared 
plus log 5 over log 2 squared. Then we apply the power of log here. Yeah, 2 comes here and also here. Yeah, and this becomes 3 hex equals to 1 plus log 3 over 2 log 2 plus log 5 over 2 log 2. Then here yeah, we can express this as 3x equals to 1 plus 1 over 2 times log 3 over log 2 plus also 1 over 2 times log 5 over log 2. Then we apply change of base A when we have log A over log B. This is the same thing as log A to base B. This what we have here becomes 3 hex equals to 1 plus 1 over 2 log 3 base 2 plus 1 over 2 log 5 base 2. Then you can bring this together as one fraction here. As you have 3 hex equals to this 1 over 1 and SA made as 2. This here we have 2 plus log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2. That is also here yeah, we multiply both side by 1 over 3. Multiply this side by 1 over 3. Also multiply this side by 1 over 3. Yeah, these three cancel each other. And we have x then equals to 2 plus log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2 over 2 times 3 that's 6 that is the value of x here we have 2 plus log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2 all over 6 then let's check here if this satisfies this given problem that is we substitute the value of x here which is x equals to 2 plus log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2 all over 6. That is what we have here becomes 4 raised to power 2 plus log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2 all over 6 also times 4 raised to power 2 plus log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2 all over 6 also times 4 raised to power 2 plus log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2 all over 6 is this equals to 60 on this side and here we have same team same base multiplying three times we have a raised to power m times a raised to power also the power the same so we have m times a raised to power m and write this as a raised to power m plus m plus m as 3m. Then what we have here can be written as 4 raised to power 3 times 2 plus log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2 all over 6. Is it equals to 60 on this side? Then here, this power multiplies and we have 3 year 1 and 3 year 2. I express this as 4 raised to power 2 plus log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2 all over 2. This is equals to 60 on this side.
Then also here, you can express 4 as 2 square, which is raised to power 2 plus log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2 all over 2. This is equal to 60 on this side. Then this power multiplies 2 here comes each other, and we have 2 raised to power 2 plus log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2. This is equal to 60 on this side. Then here, this follows on we have a is to power him plus n. It's same thing as a is to power him then zero is to power n. That is, and separate this as 2 square times 2 raised to power log 3 base 2 times 2 raised to power log 5 base 2. Is it equals to 60 on this side? Then, 2 square is 4. Then times this follows when we have a raised to power log b to base a, which is equals to b. That is here we have 3 times here 5. This is equals to 60 on this side. 3 times 5 12. And 12 times 5, that's 60, which is equals to 60 from here. Left hand side is equals to the right hand side. And therefore, we conclude here that x equals to 2 plus log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2 all over 6. Satisfy this given problem. And thank you for watching. Don't forget these steps. Subscribe for more videos and turn on the notification bell. Share this video, give it a thumbs up, and put your comment. See you next class and bye for now.